everyone! Sully here from Black Ops Toys again. Uh, as you can tell, I have changed my wardrobe from the last top five. Turned my hat around. Um, today, this top five is going to be my top five 112th scale figures. And I have been in the 112th game now for about three years, four years, maybe four years. Um, so it's still fairly new to me, but I do have some favorite figures that I picked up and that I do have on display. So let's start at the number five and we're gonna go five to one. And this is just my opinion. So you can disagree with me in the comments below um, if you'd like to. Uh, my number five, number five for me, this is this guy. Uh, number five is going to be the Soldier Story SDU canine handler. And that is a figure that is small, super detailed. Soldier Story made some great freaking 112 scale figures, um, especially when the 112 scale stuff first launched. Uh, but that is my number five. Next, we're gonna go to number four. And a lot of these companies probably you haven't heard of, but that's all right. Anyway, you'll be able to look them up. So my number four is going to be this is a figure from Terminator 2. It's the Arnold Schwarzenegger figure in the black leathers, and it's gonna be made by Great Twins. And that is a fantastic figure. They actually made a leather outfit. Uh, funny story about that figure. Um, I was actually supposed to be the only guy in the US carrying the new dual set, um, which is the Metal Terminator and the Battle Damaged version of that figure. And I sent a wire overseas for $10,000, and we never got our product, so. Great twins, great first set of figures, and the second set we never got, and we paid a lot of money and we lost it all. So, just FYI. And if you're watching this from Great Twins, I did put you on the list. You did make a great figure. And I would love to see all of our inventory that's not here. So, so are the customers. Anyway, if you're watching this, Great Twins, please make sure you send our product. We'd love to see it. Um, next, number three, and this is a video game figure, and it's made by a company called Lim Toys. Lim, like Lim, minus the B. So it's not quite the same thing as this, but you kind of get the idea. Uh, Lim Toys, Metal Gear Solid, and this is uh, Ahab in the tiger striped uniform. And they made three different versions of this figure, and we got all three, but the, the deluxe type version had a bunch of different head sculpts and some other gear that came with it that was really, really sweet. So they did a great job. Limb Toy stuff is pretty rocking. So definitely like that. And my number two, number two, number two. Uh, this is made by Dam Toys, and Dam Toys makes some really good stuff. They make one sixth, then they make one twelfth. They make female, they make male. But my number two is going to be Solomon Plan Beal. And I'm not even sure where that's from, but it's a futuristic PMC-ish figure, came with the Chris Vector, uh, came with a great chest rig, um, but just a solid, solid figure release. It's kind of futuristic-esque, and I really liked it. So I have one on the shelf back there. And my number one, number one is going to be from Soldier Story as well. And I actually have it here. This is Soldier Story, NSW DG, Red Team. And this is the deluxe version. This is my personal version. The deluxe came with a stand, but let me show you the figure. I don't know if you can see that, but it's super cool. This is my favorite figure because it's a PMC figure and shitty my shit pants. It's no longer mint, but that's all right. Anyway, PMC figure um, based on Navy SEALs and very, very hot, very nice. Just dig this for sure. So definitely, if you can ever find this, pick it up. It's freaking fantastic. So they made a limited run of the 1.6 scale version, um, different head sculpt, but fantastic figure as well. Um, that's again, one of my favorite figures of all time. So. That is my top five. I'm going to give an honorable mention to a couple different companies that are making 112, um, or a series of figures, and one of them is gonna be the Damn Toys Platoon series. And the reason I didn't pick one of those is because there's too many good ones. There's like seven, I think seven, five or five or five, six or seven, five, six or seven of their Vietnam series platoon figures from the movie. And they're not licensed, but that was freaking great, great series of figures. And the other one is gonna be from DID, and DID makes great World War II Saving Private Ryan 
112 um, scale figures that are just awesome. And again, too many to, to choose from, so I didn't put them on the list. But one more honorable mention before I forget is going to be uh, from a company called Crazy Figures, and they made the entire series from Black Hawk Down, and it was freaking fantastic. And those figures are like gold mine if you can find them. Super hard to get, but they rocked the Casbah on that set. So. Definitely uh, try to pick those up sometime if you can. If you can't, then just look at them on the interwebs. You got my top five. If there's anything else that you guys want to know about as far as top fives go, please leave that in the comments below. Please make sure that you smash that subscribe button and then ring that bell to be notified of new and exciting content from this guy. <laughs>